Good afternoon, my name is Jeremiah with Affordable Mobility Solutions. Today I'm shooting a video of our 2015 Dodge Grand Caravan SE Plus. This is a rear entry manual ramp and door, very easy to operate, very low cost to maintain. I can operate the entire conversion using only two fingers. These clamps keep the ramp from rattling. You can see I can take it to the ground using only my index finger. I tell people if you can lift a half a gallon of milk off the ground, you can operate this 34 inch wide ramp with ease. That's four inches wider than the side entry, so you got more room. Does taper down to about 33 there width at the base. It's got eight tie down points, so you can get up to two wheelchairs at a time or a gurney or a stretcher. Headliner looks great, got the rear air controls. Between that second row of seats is 21 inches. You can roll a chair up in here, the person's legs can sit in between. If it's a narrow chair, it can go all the way between there. We can always remove a seat to make more room. We have seats that'll flip up on flip up on their side also if you're wanting more room to get a chair up to the front there. So tell us what you need, tell us your dimensions. There's no one size fits all. We can help customize this van to meet your needs. The dash looks great. Steering wheel controls so you can keep your eyes on the road. You can sync your phone, auxiliary cord, dual climate control. Rear air, got the economy button there, got plugs for all your electronics, cup holders galore. We do give a free set of Q-Strength pull tight tie downs away with each van. So when you got everybody secure, come back out. Look there, one finger, that's all it takes. Very easy to operate, very low cost to maintain, unlike those super expensive electric ramps and doors. So if you can get by with a manual ramp and door, even if you don't buy from me, I highly suggest a manual ramp and door. Tinted windows, alloy wheels, uh, the rear tires are Kumos. You got about 7 30 seconds of tread left on them, a lot of tread left on them. A couple small little nicks in the paint here. It's not a perfect van, but it's a very nice van. Uh, the front tires are matching Michelins, brand new tires up front on the Michelins. So, whoever had this before had some good tires in the rear and put brand new ones on the front. Very clean body, hard to find many blemishes with it whoever whoever had it took great care of it roof looks good overall very nice very clean van been very well taken care of before i get to the interior i always like to show the vin number that way you know we've got the vehicle in our possession that we're not pulling some internet scam we also use that vin number to run a free carfax report with each one of our vehicles you can see two owners accident reported. I'm going to show that to you. 12 service records, so the vehicle's been maintained. A personal vehicle last owned in Florida, a nice rust-free area. Uh, Carfax shows no salvage, junk, rebuilt, fire, flood, hail, or lemon brands. On the title, they show no total loss. So this is not a rebuilder. This is not a salvage title. This is a clean title. There's never been structural damage. The frame's never been bent. Airbags have never been deployed. Odometer checks out good. Uh, we've talked about the accident, no open recalls. You can scroll down and see the vehicle has been serviced regularly. So whoever had this vehicle took great care of it. Does show in June of 2018. Involved with a side swipe, damage to left side. Vehicle functional, estimated damage less than $500. Airbags did not deploy. So basically, a door had to be painted. This was not a major accident. This is not salvage or anything like that. Uh, shows minor damage. So I'm guessing whoever had this vehicle may not have been a great driver, bumped a couple things. Maybe there's been a couple panels painted. That is not a big deal, especially on a darn near seven year old vehicle. Also, no matter who you buy from, do your due diligence, find out who they are. You can look us up on eBay. You can see we have 885 transactions, zero negative feedback. It's 885 people said we did them right. Zero people said we did them wrong. Also, look them up on Google. Find out if they're a real company. Make sure you're sending your money to a real company, not some made-up company with an offshore account that's going to steal your money. Also, look at our 4.8 out of 5-star ratings. See all the good things people are saying about us. Back to the van. Very clean interior. I'm a non-smoker. I can smell smoke from a mile away. No signs of any smoke or unusual odors in this van. And you can see the current miles, 31,000. 183 miles you can see all the dummy lights work there's no check engine lights on no airbag no abs lights, so there's no dummy lights on and i've got three mechanics that work for me we push every button on these vans 
the power mirror over here, power mirror over there. This is not some vehicle we just throw on the lot. Now, I know a lot, a, lot, a lot of people will do that. Or they don't tell you the full story. They don't tell you about the big dent in the door. They don't tell you about the transmission slipping. They don't tell you about the check engine light on. That is not how I do business. And that's why I'm making these videos to show you that. Underneath the hood is a 3.6 V6 engine. Idles smoothly. No signs of any damage. No signs of any leaks. No signs of any flood as I crawl underneath the van. They're very much the same. Very clean. No bent metal from an accident. No signs of a flood. I don't see any signs of any leaks. And that's the number one mistake people make when buying used vehicles. They assume things. They assume just because the vehicle looks nice in pictures. They assume because the salesman was nice to them. They assume because it's really low miles. They assume it runs and drives good. They assume that it's not all rusted out. And I challenge you, go check out my competition. Go look under at their at vehicles. Do they show pictures of the undercarriage? Much less a detailed video. Do they show a test drive? Do they use a Carfax report? Do they show you their reputation? So, you know, there's a lot of people out there. There's a lot of crooks. Don't get burned by those people. Demand a detailed video like this. And if someone's not going to get off their behind and make you a detailed video, I suggest you turn and run the other direction. Get a free car, get a Carfax report. Make sure you see the Carfax report and then do your due diligence. Find out who they are. Find out who you're buying from. Google search them. You know, find out their reputation and make sure they're a real company. If you do those three things, you're off to a good start. Okay, the final portion of the video. I always like to get the vans out on a test drive. Give them some gas so you can hear the engine run. Feel the transmission shift through all the gears. And you know whether you take advantage of our free shipping in the lower 48 states or if you come in and drive this van home, we've done our due diligence. We've made sure it's roadworthy. Popped it up to 70 miles an hour. Everything works great on the van. I've got the cruise control set. The steering wheel is nice and straight. So super clean, super nice van. With all that being said, please understand this is a used vehicle. We strongly recommend an affordable extended warranty with every used vehicle. Those go anywhere from 90 days all the way up to eight years and everywhere in between to talk to me about how you can protect your investment. Also keep in mind, uh, we don't have any hidden fees. A lot of these dealers have a real nice price online. Once you start reading the fine print, they talk about all these fees that they have. And next thing you know, once you factor in shipping because they don't have free shipping like we do, all their hidden fees, next thing you know, that real nice price jumps to three or $4,000 more than you were expecting. My question to you is someone's not telling you the real price if they've gotten a real fine print at the very bottom of the ad with three paragraphs of writing with the little fees in there, you know, they're hiding things from you. They're working money in on the back end to make their prices look good online. My question to you is if they're not being honest about their price, if they're not being honest and upfront about their fees, if they're hiding them in the right fine, fine print, what else are they hiding from you? Are they hiding mechanical issues? Are they hiding flood damage? Are they hiding a salvage title? You know, I don't know. I just know if people aren't being upfront and honest from the start, there's a really good chance there's something else they're hiding. Uh, if, if you'd like to give us a call, 316-262-VANS, that's 316-262-8267. My name is Jeremiah. Hey, a nice hard break. No grinding, no squeaking, no unusual brake noise or vibration. So again, exactly what we're looking for. And hey, if you're more of a text messenger, my cell phone number is 316-518-4377. Shoot me a call or a text anytime. And I am the owner. And if you want to call the competition and talk to a used car salesman who's going to call you five times a day and ask you if you're ready to make a deal, you feel free. Call the competition. Enjoy that. I also want you to ask the competition, are they dedicated enough to customer service to give you the owner's cell phone number because I'm the owner, you have my cell phone number, I am dedicated enough to customer service that if you have a problem, you can reach out to me anytime. Test the competition, see if they are dedicated like we are. Uh, we do take trade-ins, we, we can take them from across the country, talk to me about how, the, how those work. And we do have financing available. We can send an application to your phone or your email address. And if you're old school, if computers aren't your thing, pick up the phone, give me a call, We'll take an application over the phone. It'll only take five minutes. And if you'd like to see our entire inventory with detailed videos, free Carfax reports, and dozens of pictures, check us out, www.mobility.com.
mobility316.com that's mobility316.com and as always thank you so much for checking out affordable mobility solutions where mobility is affordable call us today